Democrat. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Yesterday, Public Works pled guilty to three labour code violations in relation to the Fleet Street plant boiler explosion that three years ago claimed the life of engineer and father of four, Peter Kennedy, and injured two others. These losses may have been prevented had the department complied with the law requiring hazard training. Will the minister today, Mr. Speaker, after taking three years to plead guilty, stand in this place and apologize to these workers and families for the harm and loss suffered because of her department's failure? Yeah. Honourable Minister of Public Works. Thank you. Well, Mr. Speaker, this has been a terrible tragedy. Uh, all of the employees at Public Works this, uh, have been feeling this for the last three years with this employee's family. And uh, it has been a very difficult time for the family and for the employees who worked with the deceased. Our thoughts and prayers go out to the family, and Mr. Speaker, I can say that since this uh, did happen, we've introduced enhanced training and management oversights for all heating and cooling plants in the National Capital Region. We've been working closely with the union, and I can tell you that the union uh, had Donna Lackey said that they're confident that the measures that we've put in place will ensure the proper training so this doesn't happen again. And again, our pr thoughts and prayers go out to the family. Sure.